Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere out in Missouri with JC News Now, as he is calling the Christian County Clerk's Office. And, well, once again, he shows his ignorance of anything and everything having to do with the law and the Constitution. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Okay, that was Judge Laura Johnson. Laura Johnson. All right. Uh, how do you feel about the order? Uh, hello? Uh, I oh. don't have a comment on it. No comment? I mean, you know, the freedom of the press is very important. And Hey, uh, Jimmy, you do realize that the county clerk has no authority to question a judge's order on whether or not uh, you can film in a courthouse or not. If you have uh, grievances with that order that uh, the judge did in the Christian County Courts, then you should take it up with the court system itself. But I doubt it'll go anywhere because... Well, there are so many other courts in the United States that do this for good reason because of attorney-client privilege, jurors walking around and everything else that can uh, take place in a building that is a threat against security should it be filmed. So do you have any brains in that little head of yours or uh, is it just filled with uh, air? Article 6 of the Constitution says that any law repugnant to the Constitution is null and void. So is he going to have the cops enforce this order if I come in there and try to film? Uh, yeah, you really should check your wording on these things, dude, because the Constitution doesn't exactly say that. I mean, if you would actually read Article 6 and uh, see that it says the Constitution or the laws of each state, then you would realize how pathetically wrong you are on this front. I mean, sure, yeah, there are things that, can, that are against the Constitution and that's taken care of in courts, which if you think that this is unconstitutional, then go to the court system and fight it out in there. But don't pretend that you know all the laws when you don't actually know them or even the Constitution itself, because you have utterly failed at this part, dude. So try again. <laughs> I'm not, I, can't, I can't say how they're going to enforce it. I don't know. I'm not on that end. Well, I can tell you, they forcibly pushed me out the door. Oh, poor baby. Hmm. Yeah, just for wanting to film my interaction. I was trying to get a com police complaint for him, and I guess this is how they avoid transparency in Christian County. Any comment on that? No. Nope. All right, and what's your name? No. Nope. You're not going to give your name? Have a good day. But, but wait a minute, you're a city a tax funded employee. You're not going to give your name. I'll come and do a records request and get it. That's fine. All right, if if I do that, it, I'm going to post it for the world to see so nobody ever has to ask you again. Or you can just tell me. No, I'd rather not. Okay, I'm going to post your salary and everything, ma'am. Oh my God, who the hell cares? <laughs> Thank you. Well, I, I really would like your name. You're funded by the people. You're using our tax dollars. You can at least give your name, correct? Uh, nope, I'm not going to give my name. Okay. I want to be quoted. Thank you. And you're in the circuit clerk's office. Is this how you treat the citizens that pay you? Good. She hung up on him, and... Well, that pretty much ends this conversation with uh, this com complete moron right here. Jimmy, I suggest you, uh, well, do a little bit better research on anything that you talk about because you end up making yourself look like a complete fool every time you open your mouth. So uh, do better, okay? Just do better better and well at any rate guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching and i will see you on the next one